Monthly Renewal is brought to you by Calvo Select Care. Half a day, I'm Clara Calvo bringing you your weekly renewal. In alignment with Mental Health Awareness Month, I have Juanita Blas, who is here with Island Girl Power, and she's here to share some of what they've been going through this past year and what we have to look forward to. Welcome, Juanita. Thank you to Ms. Claire Calvo for this opportunity to acknowledge some of our projects and programs at Island Girl Power. We believe that every month should be Mental Health Awareness Month. And uh, we partner with wonderful organizations, Guam Behavioral Health and Wellness Center. Uh, we also work with uh, different agencies and referral points to help families in need to access different activities to get them out into nature, into the community. Uh, Island Girl Power shut down for our regular business as usual to our site in Maleso and our site in Dededo closed as well as the after school programs that we were participating in but what we did when we shut down in March was we were able to turn into a relief program and uh, the pictures you see are our pictures of the heroes of the island are Manamku receiving earth buckets during COVID. An earth bucket is a planting system that allows for people with limited mobility or trouble remembering to be able to put food on the table, to grow tomatoes, to grow eggplant, to grow okra. It only has to be watered once a week. And the earth bucket is something that we have been making since 2012. In that eight years, we have made more than a thousand earth buckets. Uh, we have a community garden that, uh, that families are able to grow their own food. Even during COVID, we were able to do and to have our community garden open to the public. We're also preparing the community garden for several projects in partnership with UOG and the Sea Grant. We're looking at getting a beehive because everyone knows you need bees so that your garden is healthier. We're also looking at working on an aquaponics setup. And of course, we're not able to do all of this without our partners, without our partner agencies and organizations and also the volunteers that come in to Island Girl Power and help us to maintain the center. We have Mr. Mike, we have Miss Barbara, we have Mr. Hajime. We have wonderful, wonderful people that have come in throughout the years and been able to contribute to the program that we love so much. We also are doing outdoor sales for Island Girl Power and people are able to donate wonderful items so that they can get a second life. And so uh, when you're thinking about helping the community and recycling and repurposing, thrift stores are an amazing manifestation of recycling and repurposing. We also have our neighborhood parks projects that uh, we partner with Thrive, the Dededo Drug Free Group. We partner with uh, individuals in the community such as Troy Uggen and Anthony Mendiola, people from the community that just want to go into the neighborhoods and fix the derelict neighborhood parks. And we have other pictures there of just wonderful ways to, to celebrate Mental Health Month, to help get the community to know that it's only through our action that we're able to end the stigma. We are green in the month of May and let everyone know that you support their need to talk because a lot of the times we just need someone to listen. Blessings to all of you and have a wonderful, wonderful week.
Thank you so much, Juanita, and thank you all. I'll see you next time on your weekly renewal. Weekly Renewal is brought to you by Calvo Select Care.